Rajesh Kumar Mishra, an immigration consultant from India, could face the death penalty upon his return to India after serving a three-year sentence in Canada for immigration fraud. 37-year-old Mishra pled guilty on May 29 to three of five charges related to producing fraudulent documents for Indian students seeking to study in Canada. In a Vancouver court, Judge Susan Senga sentenced Mishra to three years in prison for his role in the scheme, which included producing fake letters from Canadian post-secondary institutions and falsifying financial documents. He has served part of his sentence and now has 19 months left. As a foreign national, Mishra, with an expired visitor visa, is subject to deportation, and he could be paroled and deported within weeks. Mishra attorney has pointed out that he faces six criminal charges in India, including one for human trafficking, which carries a potential death sentence. Mishra's fraudulent activities conducted between January of 2016 and February of 2020 in Jalandhar, Punjab, has severe consequences for many Indian students. Some arrived in Canada only to find that the promised school placements did not exist. The Canadian Border Services Agency charged Mishra in June of 2023 after a comprehensive investigation revealed that he was offering immigration advice without proper licensing and inducing clients to misrepresent information to Canadian authorities. The scam affected hundreds of students, primarily from Punjab, who potential potential deportation at discovering their offer letters were fake. Mishra charged thousands of dollars per student for visa services and college admissions and often misled students upon their arrival in Canada. His activities prompted a response from Canada's federal immigration minister, Sean Frazier, who assured that the students genuinely unaware of the fraud would be allowed to remain in Canada.